Hi, welcome back to Dubai Real Estate Philosophy. My name is Ahmed and in this video we're talking about the latest townhouse launch coming up by Damac in Damac Hills 2 called Violet 3. If you guys haven't seen our Violet 2 video, it was an amazing launch after a very successful launch of Violet 2. Now Damac is coming up with Violet 3. Violet 3 is going to be a very similar project compared to Violet 2. The only main difference basically is going to be the location inside the master plan of Damac Hills 2. This community is going to be closer to golf course side of things and we'll get deeper with where Demacos 2 is and where the location of Violet 3 is going to be as you can see in the presentation now. So this is basically a overall map of Demacos 2 as you can see over here. It is decently located. This is basically the very famous Kudra Road. Over here we do have that roundabout where we have Nishama on this side and Reem townhouses on this side. Of course, you know, we have River Ranch 1, 2, River Ranch 3 and, uh, you know, it's very close to the highways as well. Now, one of the most important things is that over here we of course have the expo going on and the new Maktoum airport coming up as well. The reason a lot of people like the Mac Hills 2 community is because it's very close to all the highways, right? So we have Jabal Levab Road, we have the Emirates Road, okay? All these massive highways, they basically make it very easy for you to get around. Rather than being stuck in the city, trying to get through traffic, you are fairly close to all the, a lot of people, you know, who are self-contained over here. They don't, they maybe are working from home uh, or something. It's very easy for them to live as well. Along with, we of course do have a bus route that is coming from our TA as well. I believe they do follow this line as well. Not to mention in the future, of course, these are some roads over here uh, that they do have that are not completed yet. So once these will be completed, you will basically be only, as the Mac uh, is telling us, only seven minutes drive away from the Shama Town Square. Currently, you have to come all the way in Kudra Road, then take this internal road, which makes it a bit longer, but eventually they will be expanding into that. And as you can see, this is a massive, massive community, the Mac Hills too. So let's like a you know, take a closer look into the Michaels to, uh, to understand what it is. This is almost a thousand acres of a community. So over here, as you can see, this is basically the entire community. This is a thousand acres. This is basically the access road that we were looking for uh, that is coming from Al Qudra Road. There are more access roads, as you can see over here, these are roundabouts. Again, these are not open yet, but as the community expands, it will start to open as well. Now, this is a cluster map of, of course, Violet 3. You can see it is very well located. This is basically where Natural was, Verona was, and Violet 2 was. That was the last one. Violet 3 have moved it way more inside. This is, of course, the green belt that is going on. That is, of course, your uh, golf course. We have your water town uh, all along this line. We have, of course, the demand mall and the previous launches that were over here we had LO 1, 2 and 3 and of course uh, more launches as well uh, and no doubt they had you know of course the park coming up over here you know the clinic coming up over here and the school coming up over here so very well located again as I mentioned this is almost a thousand acres community that is a massive size for a community and it's very well managed right so in the middle as you can see over here and how it works is that it's not completely gated anyone can in, in you know enter the community but these are clusters so once you get to the cluster it's actually a gated community so you can't enter inside the cluster unless you pass the security gate or you're a resident or you're a guest of a resident that is how basically the security works in this you can use all the internal roads this big internal road is open for everyone but once you try to get actually into for example, let's say you're coming and you actually have, you know, you live in Natura. Once you enter Natura, there is going to be a security gate and they are going to stop you to ensure that you are a resident or you are visiting someone. So it is, you know, very safe, very secure. Of course, the Mac also known for its amenities. You can see the massive water town, the massive downtown, uh, the sports area. You know, we have a lazy river, swimming pools, restaurants, of course, food and beverage options, a mall. So you really can't go wrong with this kind of community. And as the clusters keep on finishing, as the launches keep on coming in, more and more people start to move. 2023 data stated that almost 20 to 30 thousand families are already living in the Hills too and that is of course set to only increase as the community matures the mac comes up with more launches as well so there's no doubt in my mind that there's going to be a massive amount of capital appreciation and of course rental is always very solid from a tier one to know Okay, so now that we have a better understanding of basically where Violet 3 is going to be in the Demac Hills 2 master plan community, you can see the rendering over here. As I mentioned, not a lot of difference between Violet 2 and Violet 3. It is mainly going to be 
uh, the location of the units this is basically and a rendering of you know how the front is going to look like over here you can see how the clusters are going to be lined up of course you do have those balconies you can enjoy basically the views coming from the balcony and of course you can see how green it is well managed and designed it is over here this is basically a snapshot of the water town this is a ready picture this is not a rendering these things the lazy river and basically the park that they have for the kids and these cool very you know fun painted design theme uh, buildings and all these things malibu beach and the lazy water river they're already there and they're already functional so you know it's not something that's going to be uh, coming up in the future the water town is there live and well over here as i mentioned it's all operational even the wave the surfing and all these things are already operational and working and of course then we have the downtown so this is a massive park area that connects to the sports complex. Obviously, there's a lake there as well. These, you know, massive uh, Malibu beach type lagoons and a golf course, all these things. So this is called this entire strip uh, with a lot of food and beverage options, as well as called the downtown and Violet 3 will be close to this area. This is a snapshot of basically the sports field. You can see there's a football pitch over here. We have a turf for, you know, badminton, all these kind of things, a paddle course up front. I believe we have a cricket ground as well, connecting to, of course, the the beach area and the uh, golf course as well so over here this is basically the floor plans of the four bed townhouses that will be coming again as i mentioned the sizes and the designs all these things will be very similar to violet 2 there is no uh, change at all except for the location as i mentioned earlier the price as well will be starting from around 1.9 million and over here you can see the launch payment plan it is going to be 60 40 which is one of the best payment plans that the mac is definitely giving out all the fundamentals make sense again as we always say the mac is a tier one developer the mac hills 2 is a tier one master plan community we have over 20 to 30 000 people living there it is excellent for capital appreciation as we also saw in the location video as well there's no new extensions coming up it's close to the amenities and all these things and the pricing is great at 1.9 million and the payment plan is great at 60 40 so these are the four fundamentals that i always say that you need to look at a project to make sure it makes sense now to add the cherry on top the fifth point that this project has it is also having a four percent dld waiver so for those of you who know in dubai when you basically purchase property you have to pay three things you have to pay the property price the down payment uh it be a 10 percent or 20 percent in the max case uh you have to pay four percent dld and two to three thousand dirhams for your title deed now in this specific project they have a very special launch day offer only where they're going to be giving the 60 40 payment plan on the launch day and a four percent dld waiver so this is a no-brainer when it comes to capital appreciation uh, and even if you're looking for yourself, right, starting from 1.9, so even an average unit would be around 2 million, 4% of that will be 80,000 dirhams that you can spend maybe on furniture, on a car, you can go on vacation. So the opportunities are endless, definitely, if you don't have to be paying that 80,000 to the government where the Mac is taking care of that. So in my opinion, and obviously you can knock that off the price as well, right? So if we had a different project, you know, they might be buying it for 2 million plus adding the 80,000. So when it comes to their capital appreciation or their rental income, obviously you have to factor in the 80,000 as well. Now over here, you don't. So definitely it is something that is very great to consider if you're thinking about other projects as well. Uh, over there, you will be paying that 4% DLD along with a more tight payment plan, whereas over here you have 60, 40. So this is definitely a very compelling case. Looking at success of violence two there's no doubt that you know this violet three is going to be a very successful launch again the eois have started to give you a small idea of how the procedure works basically if you're living in dubai you give your passport copy and a 20 percent check we can deposit that with the mac and then they give us a token number if you're living outside of dubai and you don't have a bank account you can basically transfer it to the max corporate account or you can use a link you can use a credit card whatever you like you have to give a token amount i believe it's around hundred thousand dirhams and then they will assign us a token number then they have a launch date and then we go and we can secure you a unit on the launch day and if you have seen any of the previous launch videos launch days are pretty crazy there's a lot of rush for people trying to get uh secure the best unit now i do work with eon crystal i always like to point out that we do we are one of the top 10 companies uh in dubai we're number one actually with amar uh, we're very highly ranked with the mac anchova ellington all these high-end developers miras buy holdings obviously as a group so we do have a lot of priority we do get a lot of units even sometimes pre-booking uh, as well so if you guys have any questions or any interest feel free to let me know down below thank you so much for watching this video i'll see you guys in the next one goodbye for now. and you can conveniently reach out to me directly on my whatsapp by scanning the qr code at the top right corner